Welcome to this introduction to Speech Engine for Unreal Engine. In this video, you will learn how to start using ReadSpeaker's dynamic runtime text-to-speech in Unreal Engine 5. Before booting up Unreal Engine 5, download the plugin, extract the files, and place them in the project's plugins folder. The first step is to start a new Blueprint class. Then create a new actor. Call it Speaker. Double-click the actor to open the Blueprint Editor. Once it's opened, add the TTS speaker component. You'll see the settings and parameters in the menu on the right. You can select between multiple voices from the drop-down menu if you have them installed. In this same menu, you can then test the TTS voices with the settings you defined. I sound like this. To set up text-to-speech in your game, we'll follow these steps in the Blueprint Editor. We begin by placing the init node to initialize the TTS system. Then, we create an audio component and attach it to the actor. After that, we get a reference to the audio component and hook it up with the TTS speaker component like so. Finally, this node will generate the speech and automatically read it via the attached audio component. You can choose whether to enable or disable SSML parsing. We connect all the nodes we just made back to the begin play starting point. Customize the settings to your liking. We can now listen to the voice inside of the game. Now try it out by starting the game inside of the editor. Hello from inside Unreal Engine 5. We're excited to see what you create with Speech Engine for Unreal Engine. Join the conversation over on our Discord channel. You'll find a link on our gaming page.